said, brand new holiday at their home. Brian Goddard joining us now with a look at the holiday-ish forecast. I'm the spoiler. Yeah. <laughs> and so why, maybe a little snow on the ground for Thanksgiving this uh, year. There will be some snow. <laughs> I don't think what, the snow that we get today will not be going anywhere. So I hope you like it. Let's take a look at what's going on. All kinds of colors on the radar right now. Still rain here in Milwaukee, up towards Brown Deer, even Port Washington, right along the lakefront. But there's reports now of some snow showers into Racine, mixing in with the rain. Waukesha seeing that rain-snow mix. Menominee Falls as well, all the way out towards Oconomowoc, and even further west out towards Madison. This is all moving to the east-northeast, so the snow just beginning to push its way in right into the city of Milwaukee proper, where it has been snowing for quite a while now, back off to the west out towards Madison as well well as Janesville. So we have the winter weather advisory going into effect at one o'clock for a big chunk of southeastern Wisconsin. The winter storm warning Fond du Lac, Sheboygan and points to the north. The reason they have the warning, they're expecting a little bit more in the way of snow. So here's the timeline. Uh, right now we're seeing the rain snow mix across southeastern Wisconsin and it is windy. Wind chills have dropped into the teens and 20s after being 47 earlier this morning. By five o'clock, the light snow showers continue to fall. It's going to be windy temperatures in the lower 30s and about an inch to maybe some two inch reading west of Milwaukee. There will be snow on the interstate system and of course the side streets and your driveways and sidewalks around 5, 6 o'clock. By 10 o'clock, still some snow showers, but beginning to taper off just a little bit and still windy and cold. And by morning, lingering flurries with about two to three inches of snow here in Milwaukee. Areas to the west and to the north will be picking up more than that. In fact, here's what it looks like by five o'clock. About an inch here in Milwaukee, Racine and Port Washington, about two inches out towards Waukesha and could pick up two to three, maybe even as much as four inches of snow out toward the Dells where it has been snowing longer. The future snowfall, and this is up till tomorrow morning, uh, I think it's going to be a little bit more than what this computer model is saying. I think we're going to be closer to that two and a half to maybe three inch amount in Milwaukee. Uh, we'll be about three to three and a half in Waukesha and you're going to see some four to five inch totals off to the west. May even see an isolated six inch amount of parts of Dodge and western parts of Fond du Lac County. Otherwise, a big area of southeastern Wisconsin of two to four inches of snow, the lighter amounts toward the lakefront. It is now snowing in Waukesha within the past, oh, say 20 to 40 minutes. Not accumulating yet just because the roads are so wet and they were so warm from this past weekend. But temperatures are dropping 36 degrees and the winds are picking up. No snowflakes just yet in Milwaukee, but that will be changing momentarily. In fact, there might be a few out there now. Still 39 degrees. Westerly wind is at 15. So this afternoon, the temperatures continue to drop. It'll be 35 degrees around, uh, say, 3 o'clock or so. That rain-snow mix and then becoming all snow just in time for the evening commute. And here's your forecast page. This is going to be pushing right on through overnight tonight. We'll have this just a flurries left over by morning. Accumulation of 2 to 3 inches of snow in Milwaukee. 22 degrees for your low temperature. Wind chills will be in the single digits. So I hope you enjoyed the warmer temperatures the past couple of days. Tomorrow's high only 28. Your seven day forecast shows 28 tomorrow. Those morning flurries, afternoon sun, some light snow on Wednesday, busy travel day. Right now it looks to be less than an inch, but any snow on Wednesday makes some folks not so happy. Thursday will be sunny and cold. How about a high of 22? 30 for Friday after a morning low of 10 for the shoppers. And then it does warm up. We could even hit 40 degrees by Saturday before cooling back down on Sunday.